So, uh, my car broke down. Now I'm fucking uh, stuck. Wait, so... We're, f we're fucking stuck. What up, wrestling friends? It is Marie Shadows, your host, and you are tuning into episode two of the Ring Crew Vlog. Thank you for joining me and watching this video all the way to the end. I'm currently here in Queens waiting for my other peeps to walk with me to the rental place where we can get a rental car and go on this wrestling show. You guys will be seeing a lot more wrestlers on this vlog as I continue to just videotape everything, ask some questions, have them answer my questions, and have an all good fun day at a wrestling show. So I hope you guys stay with me to the end. And if you do, make sure to like and support. I'll see you in the next segment. Small circles. Small circles, JD. You ever talk about that story about the, about the forks? The forks? The who? The forks? Listen. <laughs> hey, I had a long day at work, bro. I'm sorry for your long day at work. He obviously does. He says small circles. Oh, yeah. Slip one. I don't know why this guy decided to go. You can't go, brother. It's a red light. Huh? Just go back to your fucking circles. I'm, 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 I'm doing it already. That was a fucking shoot right there. I, I, I don't stop. Oh, God. Just keep going. I'm going. Hey, hey, who's right. What are you doing, bitch? Oh, you got cut. Damn, I was trying to follow my homie, but this freaking Honda Civic. Hey, you, you a Kia? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I can't. No, I realize I can't even talk shit. I'm a Kia. Turn right onto Twelfth Avenue. Hold the phone. So listen, like we should have got a bottle of water. I can just see. We finally made it out of New York City. I don't understand why that Saturday was filled with traffic. Traffic, I didn't miss you. So here we are in Jersey, finally. And we're still on the road. We're still in Jersey, heading into PA, and we got caught in the rainstorm. We were totally all right, but Mother Nature was like, we're just gonna rain and rain, and then sunshine, and then rain. Some more rain, and rain. And once we made it into PA, we went to Dairy Queen because we were starving. And then we're at the show and I'm taking pictures of my guys in their natural habitat with smiles all around. And we also caught the Ace Austin of Impact Wrestling taking on Joey Ace. Oh hey look, it's Ace Austin. Oh hey look, it's Lunova. Oh, hey, look, it's one of my Twitter followers, Joey Ace. He was mad cool during the event, and you guys get to see the next video. Hey, guys, I'm here with Joey Ace. He just wrestled Ace Austin. There was an amazing match. So here's my question. The first one is, what is your childhood movie? Your favorite childhood movie? My favorite childhood movie. I had to think over the top of my head right now. Blood sport. Blood sport. I work out to the Kuma thing. All right, this is gonna be very interesting for the next part. What's up? The next part is, is that um, if um, if you have a chance to remake it, who would you cast alongside you? Definitely Moro, the villain. I'll take Dark Lord out. It'll be a five-star fight up in that All right, Joey, so then where to find you at? If you want to find me? Find me on Instagram at JoeyAce88. You can find me on the Twitter at JoeyAce1988. You can have me on Facebook, JoeyAce. If I don't request you as a friend, that means I'm capped at my limit. But you can follow. Follow me on all three of those bad boys. All right, man. Thank, Thank you, you so much. much. I'm here with Sambo Show, and I have two questions for them. The first question is. What is your favorite childhood movie? Oh, my favorite childhood movie? Ooh, that to be Star Wars. 
Star Wars. And when I say Star Wars, move them up in the arms. I don't do that whole, oh, it's a, a new hole. It's a return of the Jedi. It's all of them. You gotta have all of them. It's episode one through nine. And I know what I say, ah, oh, the nine one. Star Wars. What's yours? Boom. Okay. Robin Williams. All right, so question number two is, if you had the chance to remake the movie, who would you cast alongside you? Oh, if I could be if I could be in, oh my God. I guess I would keep James Earl Jones as, as Darth Vader, that has to be in it. Um, I would probably be Han Solo, because I think I can pull that off. He would be Chewie, obviously, obviously. And, um, woo! Christina Maria as Luke Skywalker. The oh, yeah. She got the force. So what's the question again? Uh, who would you cast alongside you for your movie? For my movie? Yeah. Recast. Yeah. Recast. 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 Yeah. For a book? Yeah, it could be anybody. Your friends? Yeah, of actors? TBA. Uh, I got customers. <laughs> to be an <announced. laughs> No idea. No idea. I wouldn't tell you right away. I don't know. I got I got to sell merch. Do you need me, Roxy? <laughs> Roxy needs me. It's not that I don't want to answer, but I don't want to give a shitty answer. Fine, it'll be me and you then. That was rude. <laughs> which, which, by the way, I know I know you like Star Wars. Of course. I like Star Trek. Oh, my dad is actually the biggest Star Trek fan. Oh, really? Yeah, he actually, when I was small, he uh, did uh, toy models for Star Trek. So it was the Enterprise, the model for New Generation, yeah. for Next Generation. He gave me the Ferengi and the Klingon ships, hung them up on my room, and that was like my little good night every night was watching Star Trek ships on my phone on my scene. Oh man. Yeah, I lived one of those lives. I'm still upset because I didn't expect that me answering that question was gonna take me to make a cast. So I'm like, and a butter. You're the camera one too. You're he's the one that loves it. Yeah. That was shocking. <laughs> Alright, okay. Quickly, quickly your socials. Uh, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, at Real Mr. Go Look, follow us, follow the Sambo Show on Facebook, uh, hashtag Sambo Show, Tyler Andrews. Yeah, that I can answer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. There you go. So, sweetie, find Facebook at the Sambo Show. And we also have a YouTube channel. Go ahead and enjoy all our previous, all our previous episodes. We talk about everything, including movies. It's just that, you know, we kind of get prepared, not like last minute, like on the fly. I do this all the time. I can see. But hey, she asked me and I said, go ahead and shoot it. She should good. And what else? Well, after the Sambo show, you you gave already your platform. Yeah. Well, then at Siler Wolf, at Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and is there another one? Oh, and YouTube. All right, thanks, guys. <laughs> Just giving you a quick update again. It's Marie Shadows. Thank you for tuning in to the Ring Crew vlog. I have some amazing wrestlers on here that I just quickly interviewed with my non wrestling questions. And we finally made it to the venue. We were stuck in traffic all the way in the Bronx, coming all the way over here to PA. And that shit was so annoying. Super annoying. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. This isn't the end. We still have to get back home to New York and hopefully that we do. Just know that meeting Ace Austin of Impact Wrestling was amazing. He's a cool dude. And also meeting Joey Ace is also a cool dude. And hanging out with Sambo Show are my favorite 
They are one of my favorite tag teams to hang out. They have so much energy, so much passion for what they do. And they definitely love to help out fans and stuff like this, especially something small as this here, because I don't usually do this. I'm trying to break out of my comfort zone, and I hope you guys appreciate that I'm trying something different other than regular podcasting where I break down matches and tell you about the stories and matches and everything like that that I do on the Square Circle podcast. So you could probably hear them inside. We're at the main event where it's Alpha Junior taking on another wrestler who's masked and apparently uh, is the product of a thousand deaths. Yeah, um, I have some pictures for that in this vlog as well. But again, make sure to like and support and I'll see you guys later. It is I, Marie Shadows and JD Alpha trying to find Cuzzo and Icebox Walter Diaz in the CVS pharmacy and trying our best to uh i don't know what do you say alpha what, what, what are we doing oh he's checking up don't shoot <laughs> okay this is kazo this is kazo it's <laughs> <laughs> all right so that was anticlimactic it was but don't worry, I got it, I got it, I got it. I got it. All right, so what are we gonna do? We're gonna... We're just gonna fucking leave him here. <laughs> Let's just do that. We're definitely gonna leave him here. Like we almost did last time. We just made a U-turn. Oh look, there goes Walter Diaz and Cuzzle there. You know. <laughs> what the fuck was that? I don't know. Did you guys not give me my water? What? Oh my god, they forgot my water! Damn. Uh, you wanna like leave them? Yeah, let's go. I, I said I want a water! Since when? <laughs> when he asked! Oh, I, I wasn't listening. Of course you weren't! You don't listen! I don't listen. <laughs> I do, I'm a doer. Alright, let's just, let's just get going. <laughs> Come on guys! Well, if you stop running, I'm not running. Come on, Let's go. we gotta get back to the fucking city. Let's go. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> <laughs> He's about to die. Oh my fuck. <laughs> fucking asses forgot my water. You think I have to fit in your fucking water? <laughs> All right, so what? We can't be here. Let's go! <laughs> Alright, if the bus will leave. <laughs> Their freaking gear is in the car. What are you doing? Why are you. Why? <laughs> <laughs> Look at them. Come back. <sighs> they totally forgot my fucking water. Jasmine, yo. <laughs> <laughs> it took you guys like fucking 10 minutes what to get here. What? Like, what the fuck is wrong with you guys? Oh, you ran off fucking drive while I'm trying to get in, you simple bitch. And you guys totally forgot my fucking water. That was not my fault. That was your fault. You asked. I much. did ask. Shut up. I you got water right here. I have water too, but mine is so piss water. What are you talking about? It's 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 like really hot. That's why I want a cold one, dude. Room temperature is good for your body. No, man, I need cold water. All right, whatever. We're going. I'll put your address. Ladies, man. We left the venue. All we wanted to do was get home, be in our beds, under our blankets, probably, maybe not. It's summer, you know. Cuddle and just laugh about today and how awesome it was. But no, and so it begins. Us almost getting stranded in New Jersey. Hey guys, what's up? It's Marie Shadows. As you can see, I am not in a jungle, but it looks like I'm in a jungle. 
I'm basically walking in Central Park, doing my daily walks. I'm so out of breath. I need to lose this pandemic weight. Anyway, I want to make this quick video because I didn't have a proper ending to the vlog that I was doing on Saturday at the Pennsylvania show. And it was me, my crew, JD Alpha, Icebox Walter Diaz was with us in the car, and also we had Big Cuzzo of Too Good. And so we went to Philadelphia, we went to a promotion called NEW, and you know, I filmed my vlog there with everybody. I managed to get Joey Ace on the vlog, I managed to get my favorite tag team, The Sambo Show. They're really cool. Uh, they answered uh, my awesome questions, and you guys are gonna see that. But what you guys don't know is what happened at the end of that day, that night. We almost got stuck in Jersey. We made it out of PA, got to Jersey, and our car broke down, and we were in the middle of nowhere, staring into the darkness. Aside from us is a bunch of trees and huge forest vegetation, and like, maybe we saw some bear eyes? There was bears there. Um, so our car is completely broken down. It's a rental. We tried calling the rental place. They basically, was gonna send a tow truck in the morning and then we were by ourselves. I do have to say that New Jersey people are very helpful. Uh, they helped us out with trying to get the car back and running, but it didn't work, it happened twice. And then all of a sudden we managed to get a lift to the place that we were at. The place that we were at had no service at all. I couldn't do anything and I'm on an Android phone. Most of the people that was with us, well, only three, not most of them. They have iPhones, and it seems like iPhones are the winner of that. So, the rental broke down. We managed to get a Lyft driver. The Lyft driver brought us home to 42nd Street Times Square here in New York City, and we all made it home very, very safely. I do have like a 30 second video of the car being recorded to being broken down and us trying our very best to get home. We managed to get home and uh, now the vlog is complete. So now you guys know what happened and there's no weird ending to anything. Oh, and by the way, I didn't lose my mind like that episode of being the elite that Hangman lost his mind in the jungle. But I mean, it's really nice out here. Um, and I'm on my daily walks just because it's a lot more healthier approach and everything. So what you see on the vlog is wrestlers matches and very fun conversations with the wrestlers that are very dear to me and my friends and me trying to get over my shyness of talking to a camera, talking to people. I'm very awesome without a camera in front of me, but I try my best. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed the vlog. If you do, make sure to support. Also, why aren't you signed up to RavageLands.com yet? You guys definitely should. I basically run Ravage Lands. Ravage Lands is a passion project that consists of me, Ravage Dragon, and also JD Alpha as well. There's writing, there's gaming, there's wrestling. You can't go wrong with those trios. So head over to www.ravagelands.com where you can see more vlogs, more wrestling articles, wrestling scripts, and my podcast over there, Square Circle Podcast. It is basically, it is basically going to be a hub for everything creative. So it'll be very appreciative and awesome of you guys to go over and sign up and also make an account so you can be a member and read things and get exclusive content such as vlogs, writing, and anything else. I really want to push away from Patreon and Substack, basically the middleman, the third man, whatever you want to call it. And everyone just head over to www.ravagelands.com. As always, you can find me on Twitter at Marie underscore shadows to ask questions, to talk about wrestling 24-7 and more. So I'll see you guys on the next vlog.